Hey guys, just wanted to share a little quick video of you having a cup of coffee with my favorite mug by Chizzy Chad Mize. Cheers, Chizzy. So when I was just out of art school, I wanted to get some new clients, or a client for that matter. So I decided that I would look in the newspaper in the, in the St. Pete Times, and I would find the really, really bad ads. And then I decided that I would just redo the ad uh, in a better, a better format without even talking to the, to the customer. I was just going to do the ad and show them what I could do and what, how it would be better and how I could sell them on it and hopefully make a client out of it. So I found this really bad ad in the paper for a moving company and it was in Seminole and uh, it was called Days Moving, D-A-Y-S, Days Moving. And uh, I went to the guy's location and I snapped a picture of one of his trucks. And I went back to my uh, board and I decided to come up with a, um, uh, a theme or a tagline for him. And uh, so I went ahead and did that. I put the ad together and I'd never met the guy before in my whole life. And I was 23 and I went to his uh, office which also was his house where he worked and lived. And I got up to the door and I had my, my ad all mounted on foam core. And I looked at his uh, door and there was a sign that said, no soliciting. And I was like, oh crap, okay. So I'm a solicitor, he doesn't know me and I don't have any confidence. And he suddenly opens the door and startled me. And he said, what can I help you with? And he was this kind of this gruff New York, uh, uh, Brooklyn guy. And he said, uh, what can I help you with? And I said, oh, nothing. I, I, I didn't see your sign. I'm sorry. Uh, I, I didn't want to bother you because you have the sign, no solicitors. And I just started to walk away. And he said, well, wait, what do you have in your hand? And I said, well, I just have an ad um, for your company that I wanted to show you. And he said, well, he goes, I used to sell vacuum cleaners in New York City. And he said that... Um, Whenever I came upon a house or a business that said no soliciting, he knew that that particular person could not say no. And that's why they had the sign up there because they didn't want to talk to somebody because they knew they would end up buying something. And he said, don't ever forget that. Don't ever pay attention to a sign that says no solicitors. And he said, come inside. So I came inside and uh, he said, what do you got? What do you got, kid? And I said, uh, well, I got this ad and I got a tagline for you. And uh, he said, OK, let me see it. And I had it all written out and it was, it was ready to go. What we, we called camera ready back then. So he said, okay, okay, you got something going here. Um, and uh, the tagline that I came up with for him was days moving. The only thing we break is a sweat. And then I wrote the copy. And I thought that's something that people are concerned about with movers is the integrity of the movers and whether they break your stuff. And he really liked that tagline. And, uh, he said, uh, where can we run this ad? And I said, we can run it anywhere you want. And uh, I had the original ad actually here. This is the actual ad that I did with his truck on it. And sorry for the glare, but that's the ad with his uh, tagline and uh, a little bit of copy about him and his phone number, and that was it. And uh, so he gave me that business to do for him and then he also uh, gave me more business to design for him. Uh, he had more trucks coming. Uh, he had a fleet of trucks, actually. And uh, at 23 years old, he was my first real legitimate client. And I learned a lesson from him. And uh, he was a client of mine for probably close to 12 years. Uh, he built his business up, 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 bigger, 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 more trucks. And he had that tagline on every truck on the side of his, on the side of his uh, fleet. And uh, he was loyal to me all that time. And I almost missed the opportunity because I had no confidence. I had no uh, knowledge of working with a client, being a, a business person. And uh, this guy uh, sold his company to a larger uh, moving company uh, that went uh, nationwide. And he retired a multimillionaire. And when I met him, he was just working out of his home and he had one truck. And so that's the lesson for anybody in business 
to uh, be, uh, you know, have some tenacity and uh, creativity. Uh, I did the ad without even ever meeting him. And I started to learn that that was a way to do things is don't tell people what you can do. Uh, just show them because, because the images are going to be more powerful than what I can say to somebody, what I can do for you. I'm just going to show you what I can do for you. So that's the lesson for today. That's my video. Thanks for watching it and subscribe if you like it and appreciate it. Peace out.